Good afternoon. Today we're going to discuss how you can switch devices while attending a Zoom meeting. Let's get started. My name is Tom Kalinowski. I'm the Director of Technology and Operations at Colonial Intermediate Unit 20. In today's episode of Tech Tips, we're going to review how you can uh, be on one device, in this particular case a laptop, uh, attending a Zoom meeting. Uh, that's the screen that we're seeing on the left side and then easily switch uh, the device that you are attending that Zoom meeting on on the right side. So it's relatively simple. On your uh, desktop or laptop, when you're logged into Zoom attending a meeting, um, you're seeing uh, the screen that's on the left-hand side of the screen, which is pretty normal. The new feature, though, that you see on your uh, mobile device is this switch button. Now this uh, switch button here, <clears throat> okay, is only visible uh, if, again, you're signed in uh, so if you click on settings, you can see that I'm signed in back at the top. I'm going to go to meet and chat. And then if I click on the switch button here, let's see if this works. Okay, I'll click switch. It says waiting. We see my uh, uh, preview for a second and then it hops right over here. So now I'm looking at my phone and uh, that is the device that is live. If we look back at the desktop, we see that uh, that is uh, no longer connected. However, I can switch back. So I could switch back and forth as much as I need. So if I go ahead and click on switch on the desktop, okay, you'll see it says connecting. It immediately kills my phone and then brings me back onto the desktop. So I don't know about you, uh, but I've uh, definitely have been uh, accused of causing uh, feedback, although it be temporary. Um, when uh, I have to go up or, or move around the office or, or go someplace and I switch between my laptop and desktop, um, I'm sorry, my laptop and my phone, I'll connect on my phone, uh, but temporarily maybe both mics are hot or, or something and uh, I end up on the screen twice and it just, uh, just isn't a good situation. Uh, so with this switch feature, uh, that absolutely helps out uh, with this. I'll include the Zoom help link in the description below that reviews the feature with you. I did have to contact Zoom to enable this feature for us. The help article didn't mention anything about the feature having to be enabled, uh, but the feature did not show up until they enabled it for us. As soon as they enabled it for our domain, the feature immediately became available. So I hope you guys found that tip valuable. If you have any uh, questions or suggestions, please stick them in the comments below. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you'll be the first to know about any new content we post. Thank you and have a great day.